to our channel today. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic day, as always. You know, I love saying that at the beginning of every video, and I generally do mean that. And I apologize, you guys did not see a whole lot of me in the last video. I was pretty darn slammed with work, and so I was unfortunately able to do anything, but I did put a little joke at the very end of our video, whether or not it was unfortunate or fortunate you didn't see me, you know? <laughs> but you guys, I am back, and I'm excited because we have visitors coming to town, and we could not be more stoked for it. It is for Easter weekend, which we were obviously very excited excited about but one of the things that I need to do to get ready for that is that I actually need to get a haircut so I actually came to the exact same place that I went to last time we were here and if you guys are kind of new to our channel have no idea what I'm talking about this is like a little hidden gem that I found and listen up for anyone who's going on a cruise out of Fort Lauderdale this haircut place that I just found is right next to the Port Everglades cruise ship port so for anyone who's about to go on a cruise or anything like that or just got back from a cruise and you just want a new fresh cut before you go on vacation something like that this place literally right behind me is called TNT barbershop it is perfect it's located off of 17th Street which is like the main street so anyone who comes on a cruise out of Fort Lauderdale you have to go on 17th Street now for those of you who've been watching our channel for a while you guys know that I used to get my haircut done by a girl over by sports clips but they closed down that location so I had to find a new place now keep in mind I've only been here once I'm hoping like crazy that I just didn't dig myself a grave and that when I come out my haircuts gonna look amazing And just like that, we're back, baby. How do you guys like that haircut, huh? I think it looks pretty darn good. I mean, these guys do a fantastic job. So I'm actually back now here at the house. Got little puppers right here, we're taking him out for a quick little walk. I do have to point this out real quick. While I was in there, there were a slew of people in there like waiting to get their hair cut. But the funny thing is, is that the majority of the people in there, I think all but one, actually all but two, so me and another guy, so there was like eight other people in there and every single one of them were boarding a cruise. <laughs> also, while I was driving on the bridge past Port Everglades, I saw a ton of cruise ships. It looks like there was about like four or five there like getting ready to depart. That also explains why there's so many guys in there getting their haircuts right before they go on their vacation. <laughs> also, something that's kind of unique and funny is that there are so many more yachts back into our harbor. A little while ago when we had that really big like windstorm that kind of came in and it had, we were on like tornado wash and all this stuff, all of these yachts in here cleared out. Like it was just empty everywhere everywhere all of like the docks were cleared out and like there was just like maybe one or two boats that are still here but now that like the weather's cleared up tons more boats are coming back in we're getting pretty excited for our upcoming guests also the weather is like going to be perfect which i'm really excited about because in the past sometimes we've actually had it where people come out and the weather's like not that great and feels so bad because you know we go to all this effort to make sure that we're hosting and make sure that they have a fun time and then when the weather like doesn't cooperate it kind of like puts a damp on the plans and Anyway, so we are obviously very excited that the weather is working with us and cooperating with us this time around because we are gonna have some fun, baby. You guys check out these towels right here. They're so well rolled. <laughs> are you making fun of me? No, that's cool. It's you, very cool. You are making fun of me right now. No, it's very cool. You guys, Jared. Never. Okay, so you remember? <laughs> do you remember the whole closet organization thing? And I started rolling my towels. Yeah, yeah. Yes, I did figure out a better way to roll towels, and I'm actually pretty proud of it. Yeah. Comment down impressive. below. Do you want me to show you how I fold the towels? Like this? Ooh. A lot of you probably already know. I didn't know, but now that I do it, I do it to all of our towels. And they stay together. And they, yeah, Jared. Yeah. These are destruction proof. <laughs> They really are. Okay, but enough about how the towels are folded. So I was actually just getting some of my towels out of the laundry, and I thought this would be a great time to tell you about a new household product. Yeah. And I have to say, I am very, very surprised about. Jared will admit to this. She is. So, you guys, have you heard of Earth Breeze Eco Sheets? Instead of like pods or liquid detergent, these come in little sheets. Like this. That's amazing. I know. So <laughs> I've heard about these. I've seen them. However, I have been skeptical. I always thought, do these really work as well as the other stuff? But let me tell you, I've been using them for a while now and they totally do, which I was very, <laughs> I'm just being completely honest with you. I was very surprised by it. First of all, let's start with how well they work when getting things clean. I mean, one of my biggest thing is like having my whites really white and you guys, can you see how white these whites are? <laughs> They're like, very white. Always at the beach, stuff smells like salty. Constantly have guests. They're getting stuff dirty. Our pesky guests that yeah. always come. 
can't get rid of them. Little skin, get stuff dirty. It has done an amazing job with getting rid of stains yeah. and odors. This is their fresh scent and it just smells clean. They actually have a fragrance free option as well. The other great thing about these, if you have sensitive skin or get allergic to detergents, which Jared actually yes, had an allergic reaction. We didn't talk about this I in the video. I genuinely am, yeah. I added something to our detergent. He got like the biggest rash. It was a white shirt he was wearing. That is part of the reason why I was actually curious about these and he hasn't had any issues at all. None. Plus they're really good for the environment. They actually have plastic free packaging. Like this is literally paper. The packaging comes <laughs> in. So the sheets are super concentrated, but they dissolve so easy they work in any washer type we do have an awesome discount code for you guys you can go to earthbreeze.com slash jared brit to get started with 40 percent off that's earthbreeze.com slash jared brit for 40 percent off they do subscriptions so they can come right to your door if you want anyways give them a try i think you would be pleasantly surprised Britt is off doing some grocery shopping right now and I decided to give Finn a bath. Just finished up. Now I am brushing him and you guys know this is Finn's favorite thing in the world. He absolutely loves it when we brush him. <laughs> yes. Oh my gosh. I just love you dude. I just love you. You're a good boy. We are super excited for our visitors getting everything all cleaned up here. Brittany is doing the grocery shopping right now. I've cleaned a lot of stuff. Brittany's cleaned a ton already. I've gotten Finn all ready to go. We we're just doing everything we do, you know, before the visitors get here. And like I mentioned earlier, the weather is cooperating with us, which we are so excited about because we're definitely going to be doing some fun stuff with them. I told you guys, he absolutely loves the brush. Look at this. Plus, I was able to finish up all my work stuff before they got here. That means when they arrive, Finn, what does that mean, dude? What does that mean? That means we get to hang out with them the entire time and just hang out. For those of you that don't know, every time I go grocery shopping, I'll usually call Jared if I forget the wagon. This time I did remember the wagon. I was actually very impressed with brother. But I needed extra help because there was just so much coming out. <laughs> but he always comes down and gets yep. a little Finn. It's like our tradition. And they come down and meet me. That's right. And it's the cutest thing. Finn gets so excited. He runs to Brittany. He like it's wants so, to jump out of my arms. It's so cute. <laughs> and the best part, Jared gets to help me pull the heavy wagon. <laughs> So I got all these pretty flowers, and then he was holding on. I was like, oh, you shouldn't have <laughs> got me flowers. It smells amazing, though, that's for sure. Now the worst part of grocery shopping, putting it all away. No way you can snack while you do it. That's the best part. <laughs> snack while you do it, yeah. Got the groceries all put away. Oh, yeah. And a lot more. Check this Feeling out. Good. You guys are getting our visitors a little basket it's almost there it's coming along look at that i know got all their faves also yeah this person loves bubble yum Ooh, bubble cum. so you guys have not seen a tree basket <laughs> like this before i can I, guarantee that right now popcorn <laughs> almonds, we got york peppermint patties yeah this is never before seen right here exactly so, and you guys jay has just gotten away from me i have been slammed go go going I'm yeah 
laundry done. I had a few other things, obligations I had to make. <laughs> kind of swapping spots with Jared. Yesterday it was mostly I know. me. Today you got mostly Jared. Yeah, now yeah. Jared and his new hair tie. Please give me a thumbs up. Right? Yeah. Good, Jared's hair. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Did you already talk to him? I did. You did? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so awesome. Oh, okay, but I left a few things out because I want to give you a little idea. Trader Joe's, you guys, first of all, I have to say, when I walked out of Trader Joe's tonight, the most beautiful sunset was oh, happening. Unbelievable. It literally stopped me in my tracks. I stopped in my cart and I had all these beautiful flowers in my cart. I actually took a picture and took a little video of it because it was like bright red, <laughs> and I don't know, I just got like the most peaceful feeling. Easter is obviously here, and we've been celebrating all week. Got the chills. The Savior, and yeah. it was just like this peaceful, beautiful moment. I was yeah. the flowers and the sky. That's cool, baby. And I'm actually really excited because last year on Easter Sunday, I woke up for the sunrise, and I want to do it again tomorrow. Ooh. Do you remember last year the sunrise? Happened? Yeah bright red that's like, right it gives me the chills even thinking about it right that now. was I'm gonna yeah try and find it from last year and then tomorrow i'll come back we'll see what it looks like tomorrow yeah. but look at all the beautiful flowers they have right now you guys these are i think it said let's see if it says on here peonies tulips it's wow. like a mix between the two so these ones are kind of blooming a little more so you can see what they're gonna look like They'll yeah. open up, but you see how it's a mix between the two? Yeah, that's cool. So They I'm smell gonna, amazing. It smells yeah. like a floral shop in here. I know. It's so springy. <laughs> I actually got these as some gifts for our cute little neighbors for Easter tomorrow. And if you guys have never tried it, if you have a Trader Joe's near you, and they have these still inside, these are their raspberry. Oh, this is Brittany's guilty pleasure cakes. right here. Oh my gosh. I can count one of these in like 10 <laughs> Easy. Minutes. Easy. I mean, a box of these, not just one. <laughs> yeah, they not one. <laughs> Let's so be clear. Good. It's like mini little cakes with mousse, and then they're dipped in chocolate, oh, like white chocolate. Oh, baby. So, got some of those to go with the flowers, and then Ooh. look how cute. These are chocolate eggs, mousse eggs, so similar. Yeah. They kind of, each season, they have a different little mousse cake. I'm a fan so of the chocolate. So these are the Easter. I think they'll have these all of spring. Mm, so, if you have any okay. those near you, go check them out. But. And then, of course, I got some flowers for us for our Easter table. Tomorrow. Yeah. I'm so excited about it. I figured out what I'm making for dinner. Ooh. So make sure you come back tomorrow. What I'm making for dinner, right? Oh, yeah. Sorry, Jared. Yeah, Jared. yeah. Sorry. He told me what he was Yeah, of dinner. course. <laughs> so, you guys, I think we've told you when our guests get here. Probably not. I can't. I don't know if I did. Maybe I did. I, I, actually, I think I did. No. I don't know. But they get here tonight. In less than an hour. Less than one hour. One hour. Now, you guys, yeah. I'm sure a ton of you guys, I've seen a lot of guesses. A lot of you guys know Jared's brother and yeah. his family. And it is not them. It's not so, them. No. <laughs> I know all of you are thinking that because they are actually leaving on a cruise tomorrow yeah. out of Florida. They're leaving out of Miami, actually. And don't you worry, we are going to be seeing them, but not until they get back from their cruise. Yeah, we are going to see them when we get Just back. because they flew in today and then the yeah. people that are coming to stay with us get in tonight. So did we get you guys? We knew. <laughs> we always say everyone just comes the same weekend. It's so funny how it always works out. These people have actually had this trip planned for probably at least six months. A long time. Yeah, a long time. A before long we even knew Jared's brother going on yeah. a cruise. So yeah. we are so excited for them to come <laughs> for Easter and spend a few days with us. So comment down below your guesses now because I know everyone's guess is probably going to be Jared's yeah. brother. I did see one guest the other day that actually may have gotten it right, which is yeah. kind of fun. So we are so excited for the next few days. We're so excited to celebrate Easter tomorrow. Yeah. I guess when you guys are seeing this, it is Easter. So oh yeah, happy Easter. Happy Easter. Happy Easter. Hope any of you that are celebrating are having a really peaceful and beautiful yeah. day. And make sure you come back tomorrow because the next time you see this guy, he's gonna have his Florida hat on. Oh yeah. Give him the whole Florida experience. That's right, baby. Oh my oh. gosh. You're so happy and ready Are for everyone to come. Are we gonna end the vlog in the cutest way? Yeah, love you guys. Make sure you come on back. See ya. <laughs> Sam, head to the airport soon. Bye. <laughs> Bye, you guys.